Hello and welcome to Actrius Plays Quake 2. We're playing Quake 2. We've just been through the detention centre, which is actually the torture centre. We're still in the detention centre. That's the biggest facility. And I said that I would show you if there was anything. There was nothing. The exit was literally right there. All I had to do was drown a little bit um, and go around the corner. Here we are. I didn't even check for secrets, actually. Zero of one in this one. Where are we? Oh. Uh, is this where we... I don't know where we are. <laughs> Ah, this is the upstairs that I was like, how do we get to there? And there's the person that was making all that noise before. See, as long as you can get a decent benefit out of the chain gun not slowing down, it's a really useful weapon to have available. But if it's going to be a... Uh, Trying to avoid it speeding up. I guess it's not that good. <laughs> I was sort of expecting to find a, a button that would make that go up and down, but that's okay. <sighs> Just works now. Okay. Salon zero of one secrets in this place. I'm honestly not too worried. I think we're about to transition to the next actual um, proper zone. Do we want to be in here? No. It's almost like there is no loading <laughs> all required. Hey, ancient video game. You're showing your age. I don't know where this uh, final, this only secret could be. If that's not it, then I don't know where it is. And it's not it, apparently. Ah, cowboy it. But all these cells, we should not be being so precious on our cells. This was like the end. Yeah, there's another level. Oh, I remember this. Locate and destroy grid control computer. This is, uh, I remember these lasers for sure. To get through while it's, uh... <laughs> they will hurt a lot in the sense that you will be dead. If you touch them. So, don't. What is that noise? And why did it happen when I did that? Why is there a button that turns the force fields on? Right. And why is it right next to the force fields? Oh, oh these are cool lasers. Ooh, I nearly didn't see that one. I guess you have to sort of stand underneath the ones that are taller than you. I think you can also crawl under that one. But, yeah. Who's breathing heavily? Are you in the middle? I feel like a mini boss is on its way, don't you? Let's, uh... Notice how it kind of sounds like the, uh... Cyber Demon. <laughs> Do you know what? I think we use this first. But I have a funny feeling that we're gonna be glad to have the cells for whatever's coming out of there. We found a rocket launcher. It's crazy that we've got number 8 and not number 7. Exploding open? It's not uh, it's Explode open or you're a coward. Yeah, we'll just... Oh, jeez. <laughs> Whoops. Basically, it's cyber demon. This is like it's going to be a lot of make sure there's pillars between you and the tank. Oh, yeah, I remember this. It had the older... Grenade launch job. Let's use more suitable weaponry for these jokers. I'm noticing it's got a huge yeah, I think so. It's got a huge bullet weapon on its arms. We should probably use it. Right. I think maybe some grenades for this joker might help. How much uh, health is got? Oh, 
Oh, you got a rocket launcher as well, huh? Well, I've got a lot of explosions too. Oh, and I've got a quad, right? You want to quad it? Should we quad it? Quad and hyperplastic. Ah! <laughs> still cheated. And you're still making noises. There we go. Let me go down here. Ow! Hear that leg breaking noise. <laughs> it wasn't very nice. I kind of regret using my quad. That was it? That was a security grid? Just a shooty laser thingy? Proceeds to next combat unit. Alright. Probably could have made the last level six minutes longer. Uh, the last video six minutes longer. There we go. How did we do? Ori 11 secrets and it took us an hour altogether. Moving on. There's always mines. If it was a 90s, there's mines. <laughs> Main the factory door impassable. Hey, how once that thing's going, it's definitely going to hit. Jumps in the air, smashes down. Yeah, you're getting hit, bro. Just have to get over there somehow. <laughs> ah! Why are you stuck? Get out! <laughs> this is a bit much. <laughs> this is a bit rude. I literally couldn't get out of the lava. I was just not going upwards. What was that? Anyway, moving on. <laughs> we haven't actually lost much health because our um, cells took the brunt of it. So we've lost cells instead. Found a secret that I remembered was there, but also found by accident. Oh, a rocket launcher. <laughs> How bad a shot they are with a blaster. Why do you even give troops... It's like, hey, you're a new guy, so you get the blaster. If you get good at that then soon we'll let you make this <laughs> an actual weapon. Show us that you can shoot straight with this, with which it is impossible to shoot straight. Stop that. It's alternating what sort of weapons I've actually got. Like. That do. Can you move? Yes, I'm not gonna try. Ow! You see, you, you get promoted, except that you're dead. So, you go. But, you know, in another life, which you'll now need. Oh, I remember what I remembered. 
I saw a thing in one of the previous levels which looked like that, but it was blue. And I was thinking, maybe that is a thing that can be uh, broken to do something. I have memories of that being the case, and I don't know what it would be. And I don't know what that opened, so keep your eyes peeled. Is this where the rocket jump happened? So now I'm kind of forced to use my pesky machine gun because I need range and accuracy. So now when I'm going to use this because I need no range and damage. Get lost. I pressed the railgun button. It's awesome. Now you know what I haven't got yet. Although I have complained about the fact I don't have it. Now I do, I do appreciate, in fact, that um, some high damage, like the more potent weapons, have drawbacks other than poor range, right? Um, for example. You have to wait before you can use them again. Or switch away from them, for that matter. Because they all work underwater. Flashlight? Can't see. Flashlight? <laughs> I was playing the other day, um, a Plague Tale Innocence. It's one of those games that tells you to um, stop doing. The, how is this AOE even remotely applicable to the situation? Um, it tells you to pick a brightness based on your. Like, a, there's a picture on the screen that says, as long as you can't see this, you're doing it right. Like, what's, it's so dark. I appreciate these old games would just be like, how bright do you want it? Make it bright. Stop telling me how to pick brightness. Toxic conditions, load, activate ventilators. Resistance. What sort of scanning do you have, by the way? This is amazing. Appreciate the... Um, Ammo. Oh well, look, a grinder. <laughs> At least that's likely to happen in a mine. You do get rock crushes in places where there are rocks. I don't know. What weird situation are we in? around. Dangerous. You know what? I can do that. But you have this. A bit rude that you get an infinite amount of grenades, by the way. Now I was saying, hey, isn't it great that we get this weapon selected because some of the key, some of the number keys are too far away, and then I'm just not using it at all. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Yeah, this hopper is a lot. Hello. Nice. 
Nice. He dropped themselves, which it cost me to kill him. So we're even. I'll let you off. Don't come at me again. Bro. Why are these in a different order every time? I thought it said jetpack, it says jacket off. Which is a shame, because I really want to say jetpack. <laughs> Alright, I'm saving this. <laughs> no, by the way, it's been a while since we actually got our first rockets. Not sure if we picked up that many since. Out. I don't think they're the same as grenades. No. That'd be good though. That's like Unreal. I compare a lot of things to Unreal because it was amazing. Um, you're gonna. It's almost a it's a benchmark for quality this, this time. Misinterpreted that as, but I'm being very, very clear for some reason. I'm glad these holes are sort of quite full downable. Seems like a, exactly the sort of trap it would lay, lay for me. Nope. Not much of that left. Let's use these. I like how it just stands there. I am invincible. I am hard to hit. Do you know what? You've taken all my ammo away from me. Look at what you can choose from. What is happening? Stop that! Whoa, this got hard. Did you hit you? Yeah, good. Man, they don't like each other, do they? They get along just well enough to not murder each other. Sometimes. There's so many of them! Stop! I sort of ran out of cells, did you hear that? Stop it! Now I need HP. Let's get that up. You. Armor, that's helpful. Only 25 in a jacket armor, but that's okay too. It's just like going wherever you are. I got a shot. I will fire. Is there a target in range? No. I will fire anyway. Just in case. No, it's got intense to me. That is straight out of Quake. <laughs> you can't convince me otherwise. They've borrowed their own Quake models. 
and ported it into Quake 2 and just said, oh, it's probably a genetic experiment or something. But that's exactly what they called it. I can pick all these up. Because I need them. <laughs> well, that was intense, but we didn't die. So... A summit, I guess. No idea where I'm going. These levels have got complex, by the way. Um, they were reasonably... Simple? For a while? Oh no, it's down here. Let's start. Alright. I went a long way to get to that. Let's go around again. Kind of uh, regret picking up the med kits now. Stim packs. And you shall know us by the trail of death. So what's in here then? Does that really seem like the way to go? Ooh. Dang it. This is definitely designed to... Excuse me? <laughs> Where did you come from? This is definitely designed to make you uh, fall in whilst running around. That looks like a deep pool. I do not think it is a deep pool. There's an inaccuracy on this, by the way. Doesn't always go where you expect it to. Uh, not quite sure what to use now. <laughs> no cells for the hyperblaster. No ammo for anything, by the way. I don't know what you expected. Yeah. Use it. Oh, where's this going to go? I don't know why you would have thought you had any ammunition left after. Do you remember when I was like, oh, the game is this lousy on ammunition. It's far too much. I'm just going to use what I want. Well, this is where that took us. So that's okay. Ah, uh, look, you can't get through. My brain decided that there was a walkway, but there wasn't. Please go down the hole. <laughs> right, now we've taken this. Again, that was not tactical. We should have taken that when we needed to come down here and then go into the next level with all this help rather than just burning it off and never being able to see the, uh, the item again. Because it's disappeared. It's at least trying to get to the next area then with some of this left. Doing pretty poorly. I got ambushed a lot of times in a row. And whilst running away from an ambush, I got ambushed. So. <laughs> Game knows what it's doing, huh? And that took us back to the entrance. Probably time for a quad. <laughs> it's exactly when you should be using your quad. In fact, it would seem to me. What did I do? That the next uh, level is that one. Hang it, yeah. Yeah, we should have uh, done this first, then gone back. Look, I was. I'm still in this is a normal video game mode where you don't do the main quest until you absolutely have to. Ah, you're still close. Yeah, uh, that was a bit of a waste. We did that wrong. <laughs> so own it. That was definitely not the correct thing to do. I assumed everything was a trap. Like, I could have turned off the explosions that were stopping me getting into there just by stepping on that button, but I didn't because I thought that button was going to just send more enemies my way. I squandered a lot of that. Oh well, moving on. We really need more ammo. <laughs> Please. Stock me up. Oh, 
where the secrets are. Two secrets in this level. And I've not found out, bro. And I'm moving on. He's got an... Ah, crap. Ooh. That was scripted, but it actually scared me. Kudos to that, to be honest. This moves the whole thing, right? Mine machinery inoperative. Do I have any, any ammo for anything? I've got grenades. Seems to work. You know what? Now that I've got the hang of aiming this thing. Pretty, uh, pretty resourceful weapon, actually. See you down there. You're okay. Pick up a skin pack by accident. No. with grenades. Okay, just keep doing that. <laughs> Stand in that corner so that I can... Starting to get enough ammo. Hello. I'm sure I saw one of you before. Turns out I was right. It's cool that the uh, railgun is now like a glowing thing. I'm sure, it never was. That's a secret? It's under the stairs. The things that I found that didn't count as secrets, and you call that a secret. Let's see. Come on. Yeah. Ready, fine. Chips, chiplets, giblets, gimlies. I just like gimlies. Oh. Okay. Another you have to take a bit of damage to get out of here situation. Come on, man. I haven't even been down this one yet. You keep shining. Ooh. It's two of the three secrets. Amazing. Hang on, do I know? Uh, I sort of. Turn this back on again. Yes, you suck. I get it. Got oh, quite. Aha. Kauta. Got a lot of them. <laughs> I should use them. A lot. Where's the thing that is going to hurt me? Could have gone this way first. The, uh, the way out of it. Oh, I suddenly remembered the mines. There's a really cool bit in the mines. 
I don't know a secret, so still two. So finding that quad underneath that didn't count as a secret, but finding a hyperblaster underneath another thing that was exactly the same mechanic to get to was a secret. Maybe I accidentally opened it up and just going down there and finding it. Like, it wasn't supposed to be that easy. Oh, there you go. Low on shells now, but at least I've got rid of it. Um, what is this? That's given me some cells to make that an option. You actual why? I hate these things. All right. <laughs> Let's do it all again. By the way, there's another one in between. Uh, why are you down here, by the way? Go where you live. Get back to where you once belonged. Yeah, that's what I thought. I haven't actually explored here yet. I really need a flashlight down here. Okay. Now I have. Let's try and get to the next level and then we can uh, call it the end of an episode. Stim pack. What? What was that? Just, just existed. It turns out you don't need to go down there to find secrets because you will get yeeted down there by those bloody enemies. Whether you want to or not. So I've been taught now that computers explode. Okay. There is nothing currently about to ambush me. Didn't like this monster closet. I accidentally uh, opened it. I opened the back of it because it turns out you just shoot the back of it and it opens. That's very doom, isn't it? No, stop it. It's boring. It's like spawn camping. Whoa! Okay, that's good. the computer say? Go down the elevator. This. Is this a secret level? This feels like a secret level, don't you think? Please. I'm saying that because it reminds me of something that then makes me think, ooh, secret level. <gasps> yeah. I love it when I find things. Well, that's a really good place to end this level, then, uh, this episode as well. So thank you for watching. Next time, we're going to explore this secret level, which I'm pretty sure is a complete secret level. Um, don't know what we find in it. I hope it's really cool. But thank you for watching. I am going to say goodbye to YouTube. I'm going to say goodbye to Twitch, because I've only recorded two episodes, but I'm kind of feeling like it's dragging on a bit today. So thanks, everyone, for being here. Thank you for watching YouTube. I hope you will join me next time, and I hope you will check out some of the old Retro Bacon series that I've done, which include actual original Quake and Tron 2.0 and somewhere I will find a link to the ones that I did on my other channel before I switch over to this one. But anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you.